Uh, hi, everybody. It's uh, Joe Chaffee here, usually for the Joe and Joe Weather Show. Unfortunately, uh, there's some really weird internet stuff going on, and I uh, I can come on by myself. It doesn't. It seems to work, but I'm going to tell you right now the signal I have is off a weak hotspot. Uh, it's uh, pretty unstable, so I'm going to give it a whirl. I'm going to have to do it by myself tonight. Uh, I'm going to give it a whirl, and we'll see how it goes. If it starts uh, buffering a lot or if I lose the signal, then I'm just going to cut it short. So let, let's get right to the, the nitty-gritty of everything that's going on. First off, uh, I, I want to start with – we're going to start with the full U.S. satellite view, and that is the system in the Gulf of Mexico, Tropical Depression 8. It uh, looks like it continues to become better organized. It's really gotten a rather nice-looking signature here. And there's an Air Force Reconnaissance aircraft that's in there right now to see whether we have a uh, tropical storm or not. Uh, I'll uh, switch over to uh, the uh, latest recon, which you can uh, you can find on Tropical Tidbits. And the the uh, the plane is coming in from the northeast, so it's not quite where the center is. It's getting close, but it's not quite there. The winds on the northeast side. Uh, they, they all look fairly light. So this is very early on in the game here uh, as far as uh, this uh, uh, tropical depression is concerned, as far as the recon trip is concerned. Uh, they, um, At least from the standpoint on the satellite, as I said, it does look mu uh, much better organized from later today. And actually quite a bit of weather with this is going on to the east along the Florida coast, a very busy radar uh, there. And you can take a look. Uh, on uh, on our radar shot here, I'll give it a freshening up, freshening up, and maybe I shouldn't have, but uh, it's trying. And you can see there are some showers, it's a lot of showers and thunderstorms off the west coast of Florida, and they are uh, rotating in a very broad counterclockwise fashion uh, around the circulation of this. Uh, Tropico. Meanwhile, we do have quite a bit of, of uh, thunderstorm activity in the northeast. It's not as robust as it was last night. Uh, we've got a couple of lines of storms that are moving southeastward. Oop, because again, I'm having this internet rather active weather going on in Virginia and North Carolina at the moment with some showers and thunderstorms. We have a working severe thunder, two working severe thunderstorm watches up. Uh, for the northeast from northern New Jersey through uh, much of southern and central New England as this weather front moves on through. And we're going to watch these storms down in Virginia and North Carolina because some of those are going to try to move northeastward overnight. And it might brush parts of Delaware and New Jersey tomorrow morning, particularly central and southern New Jersey, with a few downpours early in the day. And you see on the loop now, we can get close up. Uh, again, uh, the uh, storm, some severe in here, but not like yesterday. Uh, we had a batch that moved through uh, east, uh, uh, southeastern New England that's now offshore. And there's a bit of a gap, uh, central New Jersey on southward into Maryland and Delaware. This area got hit pretty hard yesterday. Well, the, today they're getting a break. And then, as I said, these bigger cells that are in North Carolina and Virginia, uh, and then back through West Virginia and parts of Tennessee. Also, here's the, the storms that are in the Gulf of Mexico that are rotating around that very broad center. So we're gonna let me let's take care of the tropical stuff tonight because we do have a lot of it. Let's start with the uh, depression and tropical storm warnings have been issued by the Hurricane Center for the Texas coast. You can see it here in blue on their forecast. It's basically a track to the west northwest to west and then maybe even south of due west at, at some point. And the uh, the center was relocated on an earlier re reconnaissance aircraft. The center was relocated further south, so the actual forecast track of all of this has been adjusted uh, further to the south. And you uh, see the yellow there, that's uh, tropical storm uh, watches that are used to Galveston area, but we've got uh, warnings uh, down uh, uh, south of Corpus Christi uh, onto North Padre Island. And here is the track. So we're looking at sometime early on Saturday, the morning on Saturday with tropical storm conditions. I really think the big issue here with this is going to be um, heavy rains. It, it, these Gulf systems like this, tend, they, they tend to uh, organize as a case for rapid strengthening. But we might see some steady strengthening or even 60 knots uh, before 
uh, it moves ashore. Center's rainfall forecast, by the way, across the Gulf states from the immediate Gulf Coast uh, on westward uh, to the Texas Cove, uh, three to five inches or more. And again, this is all going to be with respect to this uh, this tropical system, uh, which may or may not become the season. A very good chance that it is going to become the eighth, and it may set another record as the earliest eighth storm uh, of of the uh, of the season. It'll also be eight a uh, uh, a hurricane yet. Now uh, uh, let's uh, let's move along and take a look at Gonzalo. And unfortunately, uh, some issues with the goes. Uh, I'm going to try give it a shot to whirl, get down some get 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 a uh, a floater image here. The last satellite that I saw with this, it looked a little more ragged than it has. Uh, so let's see if we can, uh, if the GOES is going to be cooperative. I tried to get the loop before, and it wasn't working. I'm trying to see what, let's, it's 40, 45, 50. I mean, if you look at this, it's not, uh, the frames are downloading, but just looking at the structure on, on, this, uh, on this satellite here, it just doesn't look nearly as well organized as it did uh, yesterday and earlier today. So uh, I know some conversation with regards to this uh, going off the deep end, deep end as 